Joshua, thank you. Guilty on all counts, a Clark County jury returning the verdict in the so-called Black Widower. Talking about Thomas Randolph now facing life in prison for the murder of his handyman, who prosecutors say he conspired with to shoot and kill his wife. 8 News Now investigator Kyle Payne following the entire trial and has details on the verdict. It took a Clark County jury less than five hours to convict Thomas Randolph of one count of conspiracy and two counts of murder for masterminding the murder of his wife and then turning the gun on his so-called handyman. We, the jury in the above entitled case, find the defendant, Thomas William Randolph, as follows. Count one, conspiracy to commit murder. Guilty of conspiracy to commit murder. Count two, murder with use of a deadly weapon, Sharon Randolph. Guilty of first degree murder with use of a deadly weapon. Count three, murder with use of a deadly weapon, Michael Miller. Guilty of first degree murder with use of a deadly weapon. We also got reaction from the victim's daughter, Colleen Beyer, who testified against Randolph and had no problems expressing how she feels about the man who killed her mother. That he is a predator and he is, um, this is what he does for a living. He, he doesn't care about life very happy, extremely happy that it's finally over and done. There was a pronounced media presence at the trial because of the notoriety that the so-called black widower has gained over the course of the 15 years since the murders occurred. Dateline was here and so was Netflix, as was some streaming services and of course 8 News Now, who was the only local station covering this trial from gavel to gavel. Reporting at the Regional Justice Center, Kyle Payne, 8 News Now.